Hey guys, Linemaker here from Linemaker Studios, bringing you once again another episode of Survival Madness, where I play survival on hard only, no creative craziness, just survival madness, and welcome, it's Sunday, hopefully you guys had a wonderful weekend, I hope you guys had a great time, and I also hope, third hope today, is that you guys are as excited as I am, because we have completely finished and polished uh, this little mini game of which... Whatever the title of this video is, it's what the minigame is called. Because <laughs> I still have to go through all of the comment section and see what you guys have suggested. And then see which one I prefer. But, in the every... Oh, and today we're going to be joined... <laughs> and today we're going to be joined by... No, 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 no long shot. That was the worst long shot impression ever. And we buy a shaking booty bolts. Uh, we got MZ255 there, Inferno Cookie, Page the Panda, and somewhere there's a little cat. There we go. Toy Toy. Toy Toy. How you doing, Mr. Toy Toy? This is Toy Toy, guys. I'd like you to introduce you. Toy Toy. <laughs> toy Cat. <laughs> He's not a particular great fan of being called Toy Toy, hence my, like, my emphasis on the fact he's called Toy Toy. Now, what we're going to be doing is playing this little minigame. It's very simple. We're three teams of two. I'm going to be teaming with MZ uh, and myself, and then Paige the Panda is going to be going with the new Swagalicious Inferno Cookie. <laughs> Look at him. So much style. Oh, Paige doesn't seem too happy to be with Inferno, but Inferno definitely seems very excited to be with Paige. Um, now, the goal is MZ's uh, MZ's job is going to be to get the pieces of wool that belong to us from that side and bring them all the way to the other side. Now, depending on how long this is going to take, what we're going to do, if it takes uh, longer than uh, expected, let's say, like I'll see how long it takes, we'll have uh, three rounds. If it takes way too long, then we'll just see who wins out of the two and then the winners can go up against the Bolts and Toy Cat. Um, so let's get straight into it. Let me go grab my bow and arrow so we can start and then you guys will see how the game works uh, just simply by... I can only have 32 arrows. So also if my arrows run down, if I'm out of arrows, then that's the end of the game for me. So, MZ, you ready? Ready, bunny? You can do this. And also, just a little detail for MZ and Paige, and also later on for Inferno Cookie. If you fall, you're allowed to either swim back uh, through the to, 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 to the tower there, over there in the back, there, there you go. Or you can go through the small tower down here like this, and then run back to your thing. It's up to your choice. It's going to be a strategical choice to see what goes faster for you. So if you fall, I'd suggest if you fall like on an early stage, just swim back. If you fall in a later stage, go back in the hole. Ready? Three, two, one, again! Come on, I gotta get the page. Gotta make sure the panda don't go anywhere. I gotta make sure. Oh, page just fell right in front of the door. So now I have to be extremely careful with the arrows I use. I definitely am not gonna go for the shoot to kill because then that's gonna be all my arrows gone. I'm just gonna make sure that page keeps on falling and she doesn't make it to the other side. Oh. Okay, well, I gotta make sure that once she comes here, this is where I'm gonna have to shoot her off. There we go. Early stage. So now she's gonna have to either swim back. Come on, MZ, you can do this. You can do this, bunny. Yes, MZ got to the other side, so she's gonna grab a piece of wool and run back. I think Paige also has already a piece of wool. Not sure. Oh, and MZ unfortunately died. MZ is gonna. Uh, Paige is gonna try and put the piece of wool on top. I'm gonna see if I can try and distract her, make MZ win a little bit more time. Come on. Yes. Perfect. That is the perfect situation. MZ, I've bought you some time. I've kicked aimed Paige's panda butt there. Yes, MZ got the piece of wool. So she's gonna quickly go through the tower. Go, MZ. You can do this. You can do this. And she's running back now. Paige is trying desperately to find her purple piece of wool. Look at that panic in the disco inferno cookie is probably gonna try and see if he can shoot MZ before she places the piece of wool on top of the fence Oh, oh, and she managed to get the piece of wool just before dropping Paige is going to the other side go MZ you can do this I will get this panda. I'll take care of the panda. Don't you worry about a thing. There we go panda You ain't going anywhere. You ain't going anywhere You ain't definitely going anywhere. Okay, we're being extremely careful with our bows and arrows 
Oh, with the amount of arrows we have. Ooh la 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 la. Okay, this is gonna be key moment here. What? Eh, sorry. <laughs> no, she did manage to get the piece of wool on top. I hope MZ. Oh, MZ still has to go get a piece of wool. Come on, MZ, you can do this. Oh, and MZ managed to get hit, but still stay on the line. Look at that. Paige has one piece of wool to get back, but she fell in the water. Oh, panda. Oh, panda. Oh, MZ was like looking in the chest from the bottom there. Okay, MZ, come on. We have one to catch up. I'm gonna do my best to try and make sure that Paige don't go anywhere. Oh, the panda's trying to go. And no, you can swim back, my little Paige, the panda. <laughs> You're not going anywhere. Just gotta make sure that Paige does not get that third piece of wool. MZ's counting on me, so it's my task here to make sure that we get this win. I just gotta make sure that Paige doesn't get any oh no she managed oh goodness oh no mz she managed to get to the other side i'm trying my best i'm trying my best oh no. <laughs> no okay now what i need to try and do is maybe this time i need to be less careful with my arrows and yes 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 Paige is gonna have to go all the way again i'm just gonna make sure that she doesn't make to this out uh mz seems to be desperately searching for our piece of wool oh Paige, where are you going girl what is she doing Paige? you gotta go back up there on the fences what does she think she could just swim across <laughs> what is she doing uh but i think what we're gonna have to make sure as well is to have for the next round make sure we have enough pieces of wool in the chest so that we at least uh, don't run out of pieces of wool but i gotta make sure that Paige doesn't go anywhere that oh, all she's gonna try and get the piece piece of wool there is five minutes before the wool despawns so technically it shouldn't be too much of a problem mz is running back hopefully she does have a piece of wool oh what is Paige doing is she still searching i just i did see Paige pick something up so i do have to be extremely careful oh come on come on can i get her can i get her no 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 oh, okay okay now i'm gonna have to be extremely strategical and i'm gonna have to be careful as soon as Paige pops her head there oh come on I can do this oh yes oh yes okay I only have two arrows left I have two arrows left MZ you can do this I will keep her yes and we have won oh we the victory is ours and it is oh so sweet because it's so frustrating <laughs> <laughs> so the victory victory is mine oh that was awesome i think we can actually do another game where now bolts the clown will go up against mz and myself you know what actually how about bolts the clown and toy cat go up against page the panda and inferno so then we know who we should be going up against so the next round that we're gonna do we're gonna play against the winners of those two and if we win both rounds then we are the overall winners that is a very special way of doing a tournament but it's the lion way all right so i'll reset the game and then i'll see you guys as soon as we're ready all right round number two this time we're gonna have the losers versus the newcomers toy cat and bolt the clown so let's see if inferno and page are gonna be able to get their dignity back or if they're just gonna lose again and be get the big fat l on their foreheads <laughs> all right so ready to rumble three two one Go and place your bets, guys. Who do you want to win? Who do you think will win? Oh, Inferno Cookie has already fallen, so he's got to already swim back. Bolt race to the other side, grabbed one piece of wool. <laughs> he's going quickly. Look at that. Bolt is either way too good uh, for this, or Paige is just not being cautious enough. Paige is just firing away. Look at that. Toy Cat missed quite a couple of shots. Is Toy Cat going to go for a kill, or is he just going to try and shoot him off? Now, the thing is, is when they're going back, sometimes you're doing them a a favor by shooting them off so here we go inferno is gonna try and place the wool on top i think bolts is a little bit lost he doesn't know how to get back on top <laughs> he's just running around in circles oh page is shooting him now page and toy cat have to be extremely careful though because if they run out of arrows that's it they can't help their teammates no longer uh <laughs> get the piece of wool now bolts is just absolutely acing getting to the other side inferno cooking is looking for his piece of wool which is actually right on top of his tower 
Uh, but <laughs> little does he know, he's looking around everywhere. Oh, and Baltz got shot in the face. And he's going to quickly try and swim back. Will Baltz swim back or will he go for another piece of wool? Oh, he's swimming back. There we go. Oh, and Paige is making sure. I don't know if Paige is doing the right decision here. She's just firing away, wasting arrows. Let's see if Toy Cat's doing the same. They only have 32 arrows each. So they have to be extremely careful with how they do it. Now, Toy Toy is going for quite a special little tactic here where he's shooting Inferno while he's swimming back. Bolts is like a Bolts, like literally, he's like Bolts the Clown. He's like a he's like a lightning strike going across. Oh, and Bolts got shot. Oh my goodness, who's gonna win? Inferno has only managed to get one piece of wool. And Toy Cat is not letting Nick go anywhere. Toy Cat just keeps firing Nick off. Oh no, and Inferno has fallen again. He's got to swim back. This is terrible. This is probably one of the most frustrating game modes ever. Bolts is going to try and make it to the other side. Toy Cat keeps killing Inferno. Quite interesting technique. Oh, Paige. Oh, and he got shot. So Bolts is going to have to go back. This is so intense. Is Inferno going to make it? Is he going to make Oh, no. And he's got to swim back again. Oh, this must be so frustrating. Oh, and I'm going to be running, guys. I have no idea how that's going to feel. If that's going to be some sort of crazy feeling. Bolts is going for a new piece of wool. Is he going to manage to bring it to the other side this time? I think if he sticks with Inferno, he's... Oh, there he goes. He's bolting to the... He's bolting to the other side. Is he going to get it on top? All he has to do... Oh, and Paige, you see, that's the problem. Oh, and Inferno went for the kill. He just hit him, but he got shot off again. It's going to be an extreme battle between Bolts and Inferno. But this is their last chance. There's nothing else they can do. Paige is absolutely useless right now. She wasted all her arrows. Inferno Cookie is going to have to do it on his own. And he got and they win so the losers remain page and inferno <laughs> all right well looks like mz and myself are going to be going up against the winners which will then whoever wins between bolts toy cat myself and mz will be the grand winner all right, third round and last round, and that's money game. Who's gonna win? Is it gonna be MZ myself, or is it gonna be Toy Cat and Bolts? Now they are fierce. We've been able to see their little tactics a little bit, so I kind of analyzed how Toy Toy shoots and what he does. So I'm gonna try and go according to that. All right, so ready, guys? Three, a da 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 two, a da 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 one, go! <laughs> All right, seems like MZ already got one shot. I got one little piece of wool. Looks like Toy Toy is gonna try and go for the kill. Is he gonna get me? Is he gonna get my booty? And I know he's not gonna get anything. He ain't gonna get me. Oh, he shot, he shot the fence that I'm trying to put it on. Come on, quickly. There we go. Oh, thank you, thank you. Perfect, so then I have a, a refresh start. Let me go to the other side. Hi, Baltz. What's up, bro? Can I help you? <laughs> go to the <laughs> just okay quickly vaults to the other side if I can make it come on okay I did a little break I kind of know when toy 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 decides to shoot there we go I have my oh where am I going okay I guess I'll just hide here for a bit <laughs> hey bolts can I help you with your piece of wool please <laughs> how Hi. Maybe if I'm lucky, Toy Toy will shoot bolts. <laughs> okay, I don't know what I'm doing right now. <laughs> come on. Come on. Come on. If I can... <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, I don't know what's going to be the wisest decision here. Am I going to have to go and run? Run through again and then just see if I can... Oh, come on. Come on. We got to confuse... Oh, and he shot his own man. Oh, I got the piece of wool. Good thing I didn't jump. Good thing I didn't fall. That would have been such an advantage for Bolts and Toy Cat. The fact that they could have had a piece of wool on the string. And then I would have had no choice but to be on the fences to get it back. But I'm quickly going to whiz to the other side. It would seem like um, it is. Oh, it's 2-2. Two, two, so I have to get to the other side. MZ, you got to do your best to try and make sure that Bolts doesn't. I'm going to try to bring the wool as far as I can. And there we go, my last piece of wool that I gotta place. And we win! We're victorious! Yes! Uh-uh. Uh-uh. The victory to us. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Oh no! Who killed me? 
Oh, I think I was shot by a skeleton. Look at that. The mobs chose the right moment to come and attack. Oh my goodness. That was intense. Let me know what you guys think of this little mini game. If you thought it was a fun little concept or not. Um, we did kind of modify it quite a lot. So if you have watched like throughout the week then you know that kind of the rules have changed a little bit but this is like the final final version of it so if you want to watch us build it if you haven't seen us build it make sure to go check out the previous episodes um mz and myself we are just the rulers of the survival madness orange wins purple loses oh mz you're a little bit perplexed there huh you're like oh wait <laughs> <laughs> but overall we've won we beat the champ well they seem to be quite good at what they were doing but in reality it just seems like mz and myself are just way too good we're just on another level you know you got you got you got the the survival madness people like somewhere down here and then you got the the other people down there and then this mz would be like all the way up there <laughs> oh i think they're they're getting a little bit angry with how i'm i'm like taking away but guys if you have enjoyed uh, my friend's company, remember that I always leave a little link to their channels or what they do on the interwebs in the description down below. So if you want to go stock them or check them out, make sure to do so. And uh, yeah, again, let me know what you guys thought about the minigame and if there's anything you would improve or change or if it was perfect the way it was. Thank you for tuning in, guys, and hopefully I'll see you guys in the next one. Take it easy, guys. Bye.